Welcome back to Trends and Friends. Brandy is with Casa of the South Plains to share more on the fundraiser going on until June 30th. Well, thanks, Brent Shavia. That's right. I'm out here at Market Street on 98th and Quaker. I am with Stacy and Lauren. We're going to talk about Casa of the South Plains. Thank y'all so much for letting us come out today. Gorgeous day. So, first of all, tell us a little bit about what Casa of the South Plains is. Sure. Casa stands for Court Appointed Special Advocates. Our volunteers advocate for children in the foster care system in the South Plains. We serve six counties. And what they're doing is they're walking alongside a child in foster care and making sure that their best needs, best interests is being accomplished and that ultimately we're helping them get back home with their family or if that's not possible, into an adopted home where they can be um, a, a normal child and thrive again and set them up for success. Mm, always gets my heart, tugs at my heart. So the reason that we're out here is because there's a fundraiser going on with these adorable playhouses. Tell us a little bit about that. Definitely. So Casas for Casa is definitely a community favorite and we've been doing it for over 15 years. The really cool opportunity about this uh, raffle is that we've got prizes and every single dollar that we raise out here goes directly back to children in foster care. So um, this year we've had uh, four playhouses donated by wonderful community members um, and builders. Those are uh, Lee Lewis Construction, Bayer, and Delta Pine. Um, in addition to Beaton and, and then Market Street, our presenting sponsor, also decided to create a playhouse. And then in addition to those two playhouses we've got, or four playhouses, we've got those two storage buildings from Easy Backyard Storage and JNL Steel. And then we've got a super cute little uh, doghouse from Faith Christian Fellowship. Adorable. Can I just say these are adorable? And I know Casa couldn't do this without their volunteers and, of course, the sponsors. So, talk to us a little bit about volunteers, and of course, you've highlighted these amazing sponsors. Yeah, we're, like she said, it's been a community favorite for years. The, the local community really cares about the kids we serve, and every year they just rally around them. They donate the houses, they donate um, storage buildings. We also had a local family donate $3,500 and sponsor a $3,500 MasterCard gift card. So you don't need a backyard, you don't need a dog, you can win $3,500 and buy whatever your heart <laughs> desires. <laughs> That's right. So before you tell us how we can get more information to volunteer and get plugged in with CASA, why is this important to you? So last year there were over 1,250 kids in the South Plains, the six counties that we serve that are in foster care. That means every single one of those children experienced abuse or neglect and was removed from their home unexpectedly. They don't know what their tomorrow brings. So our volunteers, like I said, walk alongside them and help them through this chaotic journey. So they don't have to do it alone. Because a 10 year old doesn't know what to do tomorrow if they're taken from their school and put into another one and their home and then removed again two weeks later. So our volunteers are the heart of this mission. They're there, they're the only non-paid person on the case and so they're there because their heart called them to be there and they're compassionate and they care about what's going to happen with this child they're there for the life of the case so they're there from the day that it starts until like i said they go home and find that their people that's right <laughs> tell us lauren where we can get more information about this Yes, so you can visit our website at casaofthesouthplains.org. That will give you information on CASA 101 informational sessions as well as um, information regarding this event. But we're also going to be out here uh, the next two weekends on Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Thursdays and Fridays from 4 to 7, Saturdays from 10 to 6, and Sundays 1 to 5. Right. Thank you all, Stacy Lauren, for all that you're doing and to all the volunteers and the support that you are getting from your sponsors. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more Trends and Friends.